Okay, everyone calm down. Don't do anything crazy. Okay, just say, hey, 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 relax, relax, relax. King 30, we're at the door about to make entry. King 30, if you're in there, come out with or, uh, Tony, get the fuck out of the building. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome back to DOJ. Jumping in here, doing some law enforcement with the Blaine County Sheriff's Office. Now, I was going to start this patrol doing a Slick Top 2016 Ford Explorer, which is a new vehicle that has been added to the BCSO. Uh, but unfortunately, the vehicle sound, I don't know if it's just a one-way thing for me or what, but the vehicle sound sounds like the Charger. <laughs> it's just, you know me, that's not going to work, um, especially if I have to change the siren like I do if like the HP siren isn't right. Every other department I can kind of get away with whatever siren. But if the HP does not have the CHP siren, it is a no-go situation. So that's pretty much where we're at right now. But I, in the interim, we decided, okay, let's just use one of the new RAMs that's available for the BCSO. Which I'm sure to a lot of you like the RAMs. So it's like, okay, that's fine too. Uh, I'm not a truck guy. So I was like, okay, I really wanted to use the Explorer. But the RAM still is gorgeous. So I'll go ahead and turn on the lights for you guys. It's rocking the same light bar and the setup as the rest of the units inside BCSO. Uh, but this one's a little cool, cooler though, I gotta admit. I do like the lights on the back end. I'll, I'll pull forward just a little so you guys can see it. Uh, it has these bottom lights on uh, near like the part that opens up the bed, the tailgate, whatever it's called. Uh, definitely looks really cool, it's different. You don't see those too often. And it kind of just sets the RAM apart a little more, which is nice. So we're jumping in here with Muppet doing a partner patrol in the S, uh, I was gonna say SUV, in the truck uh, for the Blaine County Sheriff's Office. So. Hopefully we can get that figured out so I can do the 2016 Ford Explorer because that was one of my, that was one that I really wanted to get in there and he was like, oh yeah, BCSO, I'll get in there in that 2016 slick top and just unfortunately not going to happen today. So hopefully next time. But other than that, we're going to go ahead and jump into this and see what we can get into. Looks like we're going to be heading out to a supervisor request in the Blaine County area, which is actually going to be at the Sandy Shores Police Station. So we'll kind of be able to see what's going on. I have a feeling it's going to be some type of 1015 arrest and they're not liking what happened. So we're going to have to go down there and try to mediate the situation if possible. See if I can smash past these cars here. Come on, people. Get out of the way. That is a lot of fog. Holy shit. That is way more fog than I was expecting. Oh, it's a bike unit. Sit it behind a rock. That guy's in actually a relatively good spot, to be truthfully honest. You can see him coming from this direction, but you can't really see him from the direction that you're traveling in over there. Not bad. Not bad. Ten on, uh, I'll give him a 9 out of a 10 on the spot location. All right, we're pulling up into Sandy Shores here. Looks like we're going to be dealing with, I think, a highway patrol. But he doesn't... I don't think he has a prisoner. It just kind of looks like he pulled up hella jank. That guy looked like he pulled up hella jank. Oh, the unicorn mask, motherfucker. King 5023. God dang it. Is this the same guy that we've been dealing with? <laughs> yep. Alright, how you doing? I'm gonna block the door. Oh, hello! You, you can already guess it. Um, stop this man. <laughs> There's like you a shit was... ton of guns yeah, over yeah, in the corner. Yeah, I have reasonable Whoa. suspicion like that right, he's right. under oh. the influence of narcotics. 10, 11, traffic on ready, he's lying. He admitted, he stated to me that... I don't think he's he lying. ...meth within an hour ago. Like nope. And that he's still feeling the effects of it. Now I'm just wondering what can seven, I do seven, on my part. The officer came up to me and he said, Hello, yeah, Zan, the no, unicorn sir. mask. Would you uh, like some drugs? Three vehicles, <laughs> three vehicles, <laughs> the way he says it, it's good. You should be 30 careful. You should arrest him. Who, is, who, is you, who are you saying is selling drugs? So there's one in the UPS man over there. Okay. So are you on drugs? Uh, I cannot confirm or deny. Three, Romeo 65. Romeo 65 will be. Hey, I just want okay, I can check the penal code and, and see what our laws are on public intoxication, whether it just yeah. falls under alcohol or if it falls under controlled substance. But if we can't really determine that he's actually under a controlled substance, it's hard to uh, to get him on a crime like that. If that makes any sense. Um, okay. Hello, so, me, I just uh, need you to sit tight. Can you take a seat and stop dancing? I'm going to try to figure that. Why are you here? That's my question. Why are you in the station? I 
I came to get a drink. Why would you come here to get a drink? There's a 24-7 store down the road. Yeah, but free water, though. That's no free water. I got a... I gotta it clean off the thing. He kind of put his lips around the nozzle on the, yeah. Okay. Drug. All right. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna look through my book here there. since we've had the penal code update, and I'll see what we can, we can do. You wanted to give me a second. All right. Yeah, of course. Thank you, sir. Okay. Okay. I'm just gonna see what's going on. It seems to be broken. I can clear it with my lips if you want me to. It's not letting me go 41. Really? I know. Maybe log out, I, log back I in. I was, and then it crashed, and log then now I can't go. do anything. Um. Five David five eight one five David five four two. New call sign. My first number one five eight two one two four eight ten thirty two. Request. Can't sit down. Seven, 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 do you know seven, what um under the influence would be? Ten, four, five, what where that falls under? Uh, if I could let me look real quick. Okay. Don't talk to me then. It's rude. It'd be under public. Health, maybe? Yeah, uh, public intoxication, uh, crimes against public health and did, safety. I wonder if Title six. Attention. Five, David, four, four, two. Title six, okay. Can, can you route me another 32 to this location? Uh, we have six people against two of us. Six people against two, well that's the call I want. Accept my affection! I'm gonna just go 10-8 so we have a chance to get on that, because hey, I'm you, not yeah, sure. You go, Accept three, me! So, yeah, my, my shit's not working. Clear crack attached to corner 158. Tale of a controlled substance under the influence of a controlled substance, which is 100 seconds and a $2,000 fine. Public intoxication. Furnishing alcohol to a minor. Talking? Possession of marijuana in excessive amounts. Talking, man. The only problem is if we can get him to tell us. Hello? That he's under it, I guess it would make a little more sense for us to do that. Or for us to be able to take him in for that. Yeah, okay, That's a weird one. Are you trying to leave right now? No, he's not doing anything. He's just twerking at the window, trying to get okay. your attention. Oh, my attention? Yep. I'm facing the car with my pad, though. <laughs> King 30, control. King 30. Advise, I'm having problems with my MDT. Show King 30 operating under 1, 2, 4 in the MDT. King 30 received. I think we just got attached to this. I just got both a ping. The on the no, I okay. This. So at this uh, oh, no. at this point, has he has he stated to you that so he's under the influence of anything? I asked him, has he taken any type of drugs or medicine or has drink any alcohol alcohol within the past hour? He said yes. I asked him what he said to meth. I asked him if he was still feeling the effects of it. He's like a little, maybe. So I didn't know if I need to call the out here or not. Well, right, well I think it's probably your best bet if you want to detain him. Three, room at clear, 10, because of what he said to you. And then you can go ahead and you can do a test with a traffic unit if they want to test him. Because uh, right now, if he doesn't, if he didn't say anything, there's there's nothing we can do really. You know what I mean? So if he did say something, it gives you reasonable reasonable suspicion. Um, that yeah. a crime has been committed, so you could detain him, and then work the investigation from there. If you find out that he is under influence, then you can go ahead and go forth with a public uh, intoxication charge, which actually would be a controlled substance, but still the same thing. Yeah, I um, might just call it. D what in the? Copy, sir. I would. Uh, let's go ahead and get him detained because we got called to another call. So while we're here, let's go ahead and detain him so we have more hands on deck. Okay. And that yes, way sir. you know when you're right. chilling for a TU, you could just chill. Yes, what's up? Yes, sir. Okay, can you please place your hands behind your back? No! Now? Don't touch me! Hey, don't, don't you me. freak out. Sir, no. stop. Don't you no. freak out. Calm down, no. meth man. No. No. I don't have any tasers. No. Don't hey. touch me. Don't touch me, please. I'm gonna hide. No. You're being detained. Don't you resist. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Stop resisting worry, or I'm going to give you a charge. Ball. You don't want another charge. All right, I got him cuffed. Okay. You want to you want to actually Dude, lock him up to the couch here, what at the Go table or whatever the hell it is. Yep. No, I'll lock him. <laughs> what <laughs> was that? No. Him Dude, I, <laughs> what he's a in real the horse. fuck? He's turned. 
Okay. His name is Gunther. You better cooperate with this trooper here. I don't want to have to come back here. I will find you. 271. Yeah, and what comes up after that? 271. All right, Tripper, you got it. We got to take off 271. We're still trying to figure it out. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, you have a good one. Thank you. All right, you got the MDT. You got four MDTs. Yeah. My car is not moving. Car, car is not moving. Why is the engine off? Who the fuck? All right. <laughs> I don't know what we're riding out to, so... My car was turned off for whatever reason. What the fuck is that in the road? I don't know. You gotta get the fuck out of the road, man! Get out of the road! Get out of the fucking road! Get out of the road! Get out of the road! Yo, what are you doing? Yo! Lil Wayne, get the fuck out the road! Get out the road! Yo! Shit, homie! Yo, I just... I just flew up the car, bro. Damn. God damn. <laughs> uh, we out, fool. It's gonna be zero nine seven. What the fuck right. was that? Fuck. I just flew out the car. Well, wear, wear a fucking seatbelt. <laughs> fucking dumbass. Stupid. Finally, some random shit when you just drive around. That's what I like to see. I don't know if this is the right location unless it's at the front. I have no idea. What we're going to. the officer assist. Multiple subjects versus one uh, cop. Oh. I don't see him though. Two seven one. Oh no. No, that's an old call. Okay, never mind. Well then, never mind. I think 30, we're gonna be 10 8 off that supervisor request. Back to name. I thought we had, I had got reattached to something. I don't know if he cleared me and then reattached me. But I definitely got reattached to something. Okay. But now All we're right. just doing nothing. Yep, now we're just here. Go get some liquor. Well, I guess we could try to find that, um,. The guy right, that right, wasn't right, wearing right, a right, fucking seatbelt. Is that even a penal code law? To not wear a seatbelt? Is it? In our new penal code? It has to be. You have to well, wear a seatbelt under vehicle equipment. Part. Oh yeah, probably. Yeah, that's a, it's a, in the cat it's like a condensed version of what it actually is. Mm -hmm. So, which makes it a little difficult, but... Alright, well. This ram looks good. Yeah, I wish it had dark rims though. Oh, Some steely yeah, looking steely. ones. Yeah. Yep. For sure. Yeah, the old one had them. No. Did it not? I don't think so. Uh, I think I thought, it, it, yeah, well, it had the regular ones it. like these, but you could put on. All I did was just put on the Dodge rims, but the thing is, these have really good off road tread. So when I change them, it doesn't look as good. I could put on another off-road pair, but still doesn't look as good. Let me get my radar on. Can you LiDAR from the passenger seat? Uh, last time we tried, I shut out the window. Okay. So. I mean, I can try again and see if they fixed it. But. What is going on here? Damn. Oh, that's where that's the call I was talking about. Five, David, five, eight, one. Uh, we'll With the a lot of people. Yep. Okay. Yep. Heard that one. Don't want to see that. <laughs> yep. Oh, that's going to be the traffic stop right there. I'm assuming so. Dispatch hasn't called anybody over. There. No, he hasn't. Delayed response. <laughs> Perfect timing. As we're passing, I get attached. Control King 30. King 30. King 30, new call assignment. Reference number 158215 request. Full scoop 260, Route 68. King 30, you could, uh,. Mark me 23. I'm turning around right now. Receive. God damn, I do like these fuck. The back seat and the ram looks so detailed on those yeah, headrests. They, they look really Fucking good. crazy. All right, let's see what we got here. Guy failing to identify. How's it going? Yes, how are we? Good, good. 
Oh, uh, it's got it's going all right. I was just coming eastbound uh, up from the uh, pretty much the Joshua intersection on the 68 here. Uh, this silver vehicle I've witnessed uh, driving in front of me, a couple of hundred yards, weaving in and out of traffic. Um, activated lights and sirens. I've had to do about uh, probably uh, 100 miles an hour to catch up to him. Uh, he's refusing to hand over any uh, identifying information. Uh, feels as though the pullover has been a bit unfair. Okay, and you got him on uh, your radar for speed too. D didn't get him on the on the right after just visual been pulled over for a 1066 yeah okay all right i will be up there in one sec let me just uh grab something for my vehicle no problems i gotta save this i don't want it to disappear uh fantastic fantastic indeed thank you for asking not a problem at all not a problem all right Sorry, let's chat with this guy yeah i'm in service how you doing, sir? Oh, that uh, I was doing okay before. Okay, so what did he uh, what did he stop you for? Uh, so pretty much he said that uh, he saw me recklessly driving, and he had to do 105 to catch up to me, um, which I find interesting because now if he had to do 105 to catch up to me, then I feel like that's his problem. Uh, just because I was a couple streets ahead of him before I turned out. Um, and I don't see how me passing cars in a passing zone is recklessly driving. So I really called BS on that. So I wanted a supervisor out here like immediately. Just because that, that sounds a little fishy to me. Especially because he also said he didn't clock me. So, you know, I don't see, rec like I said, first thing is I don't see how recklessly driving is passing people in a passing zone. I'm doing it in a safe manner. There's that, and then you also didn't clock me, so I mean, I just wanted a supervisor out here. Okay, so I asked the same question if he clocked you or not, and he said he didn't. It was a visual estimation on how you were driving and how you were changing the lanes. So, I mean, at okay. this point, I personally was not here, so I cannot say what he saw. Um, all I know is that if he saw you driving in the manner that you were, then he has the ability to pull you over run your license and make sure everything's good and again the cooperation could turn this out to be as simple as a warning you know what i mean yeah i don't have a problem with i don't have a problem with giving him my information it's just the reasoning for me being pulled over literally like i was literally i literally just came from home i like me pulling out on the street i just pulled out of my driveway like you know going from pulling out of my driveway to pulled over like it's slightly irritating. So oh, absolutely, I mean, like yeah. I said, I don't have a problem giving my information. I just, I just didn't like the reason, or I, I didn't too much. Uh, the reason that I got pulled over didn't make too much sense to me. So I, I just wanted a supervisor right here. Okay, it could have been one of those things too, where subconsciously, in your mind, you weren't doing too much aggressive stuff, but from the receiving end, it kind of looked a little more aggressive, probably than what you thought you were giving. You know what I mean? And I'm talking about how you were driving yeah, for him to you. turn around on you in the first place. Um, so, yeah, I would say, do you, well, now, quick question, do you have any priors for reckless driving or speeding or anything of that nature? No, no, no. Oh, wait. Okay. I may have a, if, if I do, it, it was from a while ago, and that ticket has been paid for. The last time I remember getting a ticket, it was like, maybe like 10 over, but that was down in the city. If that, I don't, I don't even remember, but it, it's been so long. Okay. Well, that's, uh, that's again, another factor into when we look at your ID and stuff, whether or not a warning would be appropriate yeah, can, if it's been uh, a while, you know what I mean? Yeah, if you want to hand it to the trooper, we could sit here and continue to have a chat, and he can do what he's going to do. Yeah, sure, I'll hand it to him. Yeah, a lot of, uh, if the, a lot of stuff that we did was based off of only being able to have a radar number attached to it we wouldn't be doing much we would be sitting on the side of the road right. staring at our phones all right mr yeah, montana what i'm gonna do i'm get back i'm just gonna run you your details i'll be back with you in a second okay mm -hmm. so you live where oh i actually uh, live down in the city um one of my uh i guess lady friends you could say she stays right at the street behind okay. us all right, well, we'll get that squared away, and uh, no matter what, you'll be leaving here today, so 
few more minutes and we'll see what's going on, all right? Yes, sir. Sounds good. All right. I appreciate it. I'm going to sit here with my pet, pet duck. Okay. All right. So he's got uh, one arrest report from a couple of days ago for a vehicle exhibition. Uh, reckless driving for <laughs> doing a burnout. Is. Um, that looked pretty severe to me uh, from the uh, from the report, the arrest report here. Uh, look, I'm just going to go ahead. I'm just going to check his registration. Um, in all, I'm 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 happy to give him a written warning. Um, obviously, I don't have uh, evidence to say he was speeding um, and reckless driving. To me, it's just an interpretation thing. But uh, as long as he uh, just tempers his driving behaviours, then I'm fine with that. Yeah, that sounds good to me. I have no problems. I'll go uh, write the warning. I've never ever in my life have got a ticket and been like, can you get a supervisor down here so I can <laughs> tell him what the fuck is up with his job? Like, <laughs> no, yeah. that'd, that'd be, that'd be a line I'm never willing to cross. It's like, you know what? If I feel like I've, I, I have something to say, I'll save it for court. Fuck this shit. Yep, exactly. Uh, that registration is not coming back to Mr. Montana. I'm going to just uh, ask him what's going on here. Okay. Thank you. Hmm. Hopefully it's nothing uh, too crazy. Mr. Montana, the, uh, the insurance the details here and the registration don't come back to uh, yourself. They come back to uh, somebody else. Can you tell me who owns the vehicle? Yeah, my buddy uh, Alex. His name's Alex King. That's why the license plate is Alex K. Yeah, okay. Have you got permission to drive the vehicle? Most definitely. Uh, so pretty much, um, I own a, a custom shop down in the city. So what we do is we'll get a, we'll get like a, you know, a trashed car, and uh, we'll fix it up and soup it up, make it look cool, uh, just for like advertisement and stuff. But uh, so it's under his name, but me and him drive it whenever I have, I have this car from him, and uh, he has one of my, uh, I have a Masakura, and uh, he has that. So, I mean, we, we rotate cars pretty often just, uh, you know, to advertise. Mm -hmm. That sounds fun. Do you have, uh, Mr. I just want to just check in. Obviously, yeah, from our end, you can understand. I just want to make sure that's all good. Do you have uh, Mr. King's uh, mobile phone number? Oh, my God. Yeah, that's not uh, necessary. Yeah, one second. <laughs> that's not necessary at all. Hey, Trooper, was the vehicle reported stolen in our system? It's not reported stolen, but, um, you know, it's just definitely a matter of not driving. Stolen. I just it's... want to make sure. My buddy's yeah, vehicle. His, that's, uh, his number's uh, 210. It's fine, sir. It, as long as it's not reported in our system, we it doesn't. people can pass their vehicles amongst each other legally without any issue from us at all. All right, Mr. Montana, thanks so much for your patience. Let me just get my notepad out for Trooper, he did have valid insurance, right, though? Everything's coming back okay. Okay, as long as there's valid insurance, then that's totally good. Especially if you're driving someone else's car. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, my insurance, uh, I have uh, several cars myself. I mean, you know, like I said, we... Uh, That's we true. Also, the person's policy them. that they have for themselves yeah, usually covers anyone else's car that they drive, so... Kind of thing. If you get a nicer insurance. All right, Mr. Montana, what I'm going to do, I'm going to just give you a written warning here. Um, I think as we've all uh, agreed, um, you know... I, don't, I didn't catch your speed, uh, but your manner of driving to me, I didn't interpret that as reckless. So it's just going to be a written warning tonight, of course. Uh, there's uh, no fine attached to that. Um, oh, if right. you could just sign the bottom of the piece of paper here, it's not a mission to yeah, kill. I'll be over there just saying that, yes, you have been given that warning, just a receipt, um, and then you'll be on your way, okay? I think 30, we're going to be 10-8 off the supervisor request. Uh, all right, there you go. Thank you, Mr. Montana. Do you have any questions for me, sir? Uh, no, sir. I'm Mr. Montana, you have a safe night, drive safe. You'll be free to go once my lights go out. Yes, sir, you all do too. Have a good night. Thank you. Alright, Trooper, you have a good one. You too, sir. Thanks. His lights are not in like the normal HP pattern, they're doing some weird like disco shit. Yeah, that's a weird bug with those cars for some reason. 
I just think it. Well, it's because they're you're not supposed to be doing that with GTA lights at all. <laughs> Sawing him down that much. Yeah, that's true. Oh, he just drifted. He just drifted twice. Oh, oh he's three oh, times. Again. I'm married. Is he gonna run it? Let him run it. Oh. He probably really doesn't have to have any idea that we were behind him right there. Be myself and five Mary eight zero. And again. Get it again. I'll call it a copy. King 30, 10, 11. It's the same guy. Yeah. Look, I thought it was the a different guy. guy. Like, oh. Nope. Mother of Lord. King 30, stand by. Five okay. <sighs> I'm gonna chat with them then. Yep. We're gonna be at two nine nine Joshua Road eastbound with a two door man. Hellfire Chrome and color occupied times one no additional. What are you doing? Yeah, what's up? Road on the Chrome what do you Hellfire mean? Two door we just uh, we were just chatting with you. Yeah, I know, man. It's it's not my fault. I'm literally uh, headed to my shop now to get this thing taken off. I have a thing called a pedal box. Uh, yeah, no, no, I put I've it on my it. Uh, accelerator. Yeah, yeah. I'm I'm literally gonna go take it off because it's it's making me burn too much rubber and I don't like it. Yeah, well, I mean, me I've I've drove a Hellcat before and I still don't burn that much rubber, even when I smash on it. What have you have you had it with a pedal box though? I don't think it fucking needs ones, honestly. That shit, it's a fucking yeah, little it devil. Doesn't. And that's exactly <laughs> why I'm going to take it off because okay. it's making me do too much. Well, I'd hate to do this again, but license registration insurance, please. I stopped you because obviously you let loose the back end three times. Uh, actually, I think it was four, honestly. I know it wasn't on purpose, but it still happened, you know? Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Here to Sunny Montana. Okay. Sit tight here. I'll be right back. Sure. You got it in, right? Yes, I did. Okay, cool. Let's see. Tablet. Too. Oh, man. Hey, officer. Uh, yeah, what's up? Did you get this ugly Is it job up? off of it, too? Just say. Just say. It's a wrap. It it comes off whenever. Good, cause I hate it. Anyway, there it is. <laughs> uh, would it be illegal if I, I made a U-turn right here? Uh, no, no, but you have to make a U-turn from the lane, okay, cool. the driving lane. You can't make it from the shoulder there. Uh, yeah, it's just okay. a wrap. It, it's um, temporary. So you have to do it from the lane. You can't do it from the shoulder. Okay, I got you. We had a truck do that on the. Yeah, I mean, it's it's a wrap, like I said. I mean, it, we chose this color because driving down the road, you're obviously going to see, uh, see it from a distance. It, uh, Do you it think he's doing this on purpose, then, or you think it's, it's like... Yeah. I don't know. He's... I like it. Because, I, I mean, he's being cooperative. I like walking up to my car and seeing but... myself. So, I'm going to give him one more chance, then, uh, since we've seen him so much. I so much. All right. I'm going to give him one chance, and we're going to do a written warning. And we'll see yeah, if we see I him doing it. Your car, it's like a mirror. I see myself and I get distracted on how good looking I am. Uh, That's it. Yeah, you do look so, pretty uh, good, man. I'm not going to lie to you. Thank you. Wow. Hey, give him a verbal warning, not a written warning. <laughs> Stop lying to him. That's fucked. <laughs> Thanks. Use my megaphone. That's mine. All right, that would be reckless driving for... Oh, well, those are the chippies, huh? Yep. We were That's reckless, there. right? Have you ever... Uh, have you guys ever been in a pursuit with one of these uh, things? Burning out... Like, burning out like yeah. drifting? Yeah. Yeah, it would. What? Have you guys ever been in a pursuit with a Hellcat? Uh, sir, I've been in a pursuit with everything. There, it oh, is. Oh, that's cool. But that would be my, that would be my uh, response. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> I mean, if you, uh... Fucking loser. <laughs> I wanna make sure. Nah, man, that's, uh, doing a... Running from you guys is, uh, is a little above my pay grade, if you know what I mean. Supervisor's here. Okay, so it's gonna be a... I'm gonna give you one more chance, okay? Because I see you all over the place. I have a feeling that if you do fuck up again, it'll be easy to catch you. 
So here's one more written warning. <laughs> so if you do it again, it's going to be some citations. And depending on what you do, it might have mandatory jail time attached to it. So let's not do anything crazy, okay? Oh, that's unfortunate. It is unfortunate, but you're getting another citation right now. So it is very fortunate that you got this instead of the actual citation that I could have gave you, right? Because then once you got any point, I don't know. And either way, you're screwed. You have two warnings for doing some jank shit. So if you get pulled over again by anyone else, you know they're going to give you a ticket. And if you were to have got a ticket this time, they would have saw you got a warning and a ticket. So you know they would have ticketed you again. So you're pretty much now screwed, you know? Yeah, for sure. So I drive like a grandma. So sign the bottom of this citation. It's not a mission to go. It's saying you're going to take care of in court. Does drive like a grandma. That is true. Okay, there's your copy along with your information back. I appreciate it. And please, slow it down like you're 80, okay? Yeah, sure. Hey, one question. Yes. I'm, I'm going to do something when I leave, and I just want, want to if make sure... If you spin sure your tires... Is that what you're talking well, about? I'm not gonna spin my tires. Jesus. No, 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 no. I just want you to see what I'm gonna do when I leave, and then make sure that it, just pretty much make like tell me that, that it's legal or not illegal. You know no, what I mean? That's not how it works. You're gonna pull off into traffic safely, slowly, and you're gonna have a wonderful day. Uh, I guess. Okay. If you don't want to have a wonderful day, that's on you. Yeah. I've already safely <laughs> and slowly. Remember. Slowly, safely, and securely, sir. Okay. <laughs> That's right. what he wanted to do? Dude. So we just take him to jail, then? Alright, yeah, now he's going to jail. Okay, we'll I just mean... take him to jail. Alright, well, you can stop, because you're going to jail now. I don't know if he's trying to take off. Where did he go? I have no idea he did. Uh, be advised, we lost eyes. Uh, it's going to be a Chrome Hellfire Act by Times 1 license plate Alex K2. Yeah, no eyes. Alex. He dipped. Wow. He Damn, dude. Did he did it and then fucking did dipped it. on us. Like, what? <laughs> I can't believe it's we did it. It's a fucking truck, man. Fuck this truck. They got him? Uh, no, that was the last known location. Okay. I can't believe we lost him. <laughs> I didn't even see him. I seen him turn and then he was gone. Detroit Air 5 we're getting route 299. He shot how do you disappear that fast? Either this truck is super slow or he fucking smashed. I think he just smashed. Oh, check the burn. Do I not have lights on people? My God. Oh, he's right there in the Trevor's trailer. Trevor's trailer. Got him. All right, we got that vehicle right now at 296 Marina Drive. They're at 296 Marina. There's a blank. Oh shit, that's not it. This is a Blaine County Sheriff's Office. Come out with your hands up if you're inside the trailer. 296 Marina Drive. Be advised, we're unaware if he's in the vehicle or in the trailer here at 296. If we can have additional. If you're inside the vehicle, step out with your hands up. I'm gonna go around and clear it from that side. Okay. He could have ditched too and ran, but I guess it's best to clear. Yep, do your thing. Vehicle's clear. Copy. Control 5, David 442, 5, David 645. Hey, there's the... I'll clock a little. Silly. 5, David 645, 5, David 442, have you in route. Residents of 296 Marina Drive. Marina. Come out with your hands up. Six will fucking route. I see no movement or anything. King 30, be advised, car is clear. The uh, individual is not in the car. He could be possibly in the trailer or he's on foot in the area. If we can have units code fixing in the area near 293, 292, and 295, that'd uh, be on the lookout. 
Oh, look at those trucks Receive. coming down this road. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. Good lord. FFI, do have a description Occupants of, of 296 Marina Drive. This is your last okay, chance to come out with your hands up. He has long hair uh, that goes down to his neck. He's wearing a uh, uh, light jacket. Occupants of 296 hands. Marina Drive. This is your last chance to come out with your hands up. Did you get his name? No. No, I did not. Wait, yeah, I did. It's, well, yeah, uh, it's, Montana. uh, no. Oh, yeah, sure? fucking, yeah, how original. Was... Control 3 Charles, <laughs> 2 0 3 Charles, 5 0 Yeah, I guess Close it is Tony Montana. Area, 2 9 6 Marina. Tony, this is the Blaine County Sheriff's Office. Come out with your hands up. We have it surrounded. Big to be advised, uh, subject's name is going to be Tony Montana. How much longer? Do we have any more people showing up? I mean, like, I don't know I, what the fuck is going on. Being 30 dispatch. How many more units we have? Can we step them up code three so I get the perimeter up here? King 30, receive Charles 5033, Charles 220, step it up code three. I see units in the area, but they don't have lights on and they're just driving. Tony, <laughs> again, this is your last chance. You have one chance to come out with your hands up. Either out of the garage, <laughs> out of the trailer, on any, uh, come out with your hands up. Running around to whether inside a building or under a roof, you can't see them. Tank 30, I need... Motherfucker, man. <laughs> Tank 30, I need units rolling up. I need one on... Uh, let's see here. I need you on Zancudo Avenue in front of tra uh, Trevor's trailer. We're on the marina side. I also need one to be on... Algonquin and Armadillo at the back. I'm sorry, Nyland and Algonquin at the back of the property, 296. I also have units looking in the surrounding postals. Three charge, this area I'm on the back side of the property. Five, five Delta four four two. Okay, we're well, getting set up. They hit that. Uh, they hit that perimeter really quick, which is nice. Yeah, they did. I can't believe he did it. He did burn out. Thirty to units oh. on. <laughs> Holy shit! I dropped my controller. <laughs> Hang 30 to units on perimeter. If we could have you stand on perimeter, we're gonna try to go up to the front door and make contact. <laughs> what are you doing? You fucking crackhead. Dude, something's wrong with me. I can't do anything right. I have to alt tab. Alright, we're fixed. God. <laughs> Yo, my okay, I'm back. Don't worry. You need to just leave. Leave the <laughs> server point. entirely. <laughs> At this point. Okay, you good? Yep, I'm fine. Uh, air unit should look for thermals. I don't know if you can see anything through buildings. Uh, it's a Logistically. Trailer. Tony, if you're in there, put your hands up. Tony, you in there? King 30, we're at the door about to make entry. King 30, if you're in there, come out with your, uh, uh, Tony, <laughs> get the fuck out of the building. <laughs> God damn it, dude. <laughs> what is life? <laughs> Tony, if you hear me, come out with your hands up. Tony Montana, we have this place around it. Make yourself known. All right, I'm hearing nothing. We're going to need to move in. Yeah, let's reach in. Hands up if you're in here. I'm moving right. I got a uh, clear right. I'm clear over clear. here. Clear. King 30 prop. King 30, be advised the trailer is going to be clear. Subject. And I thought he was going to be in here. Oh, we got to check the garage. The trailer. He's going to be in the surrounding area. Did you check the garage? I have King not. 30. Oh, King 30 shit. to prim. Tank 30, we got a, uh, another vehicle inside the garage. Not sure if there's any occupants in it. We could get perimeter units to come to 296 Tony, in the front of wall. You're in here. Make yourself known now. I don't see anything. Yeah, this is weird. Nothing's it. It's clear. Okay, we're going to get these other units. Okay, it's clear. Um, we're going to have to search out. Do we have a better description, Josh? Uh, White male, orange, long hair. Light jacket, unknown pants. 
Tony Montana. I'm taking a 60. What's the description of the individual? You guys want a foot search spreading out, or you want us to just drive around? Uh, King no, 30, we could drive King around. King just see if, like, just keep your eyes out hair. during your patrol. See if we can pick him up. He's He's been hanging around this area the whole time, so I know he's chilling here. All right. I thought he was going to be in there, too, to be honest. I can see him in bushes, you know, just in the area. Damn it. Do we know if he's armed? No, no 1060. He just, um... We had, a, we had a stop twice, uh, and he said some weird shit as he pulled off. He's like, oh, I'm going to do this. Make sure you guys watch it. He did, like, four donuts, and because we're in the truck, we tried to turn around. By the time we turned around, he was gone. So he was evading us, and it deserves a few tickets. All right, Tonga. Appreciate it. Fuck. I can't believe he got away from us. It's a truck. It's a truck. <laughs> Blame it on the truck. Oh, are we gonna tow his shit? I say we tow his shit. Oh yeah, oh yeah, for sure. Yeah. Let's search it and get it towed. King 30, can you start me a tow truck to 296, please? King 30, is the, is the air held? Is the air held for us? Uh, it was, yes. Okay, I'm gonna clear that. King 30, you can also lift the air. That is an ugly car! That is an ugly car. Fuck. Oh, this car right here. Recklessly driving? Yep, just overtook and passed. You think that was a? Uh, I think I it was a think person though. Uh, yeah, I think it's yeah, one hundred percent. But is it Tony? Is I don't know. We're Tony? gonna find out. Oh my! No. <laughs> in, <laughs> <what>? <laughs> Probably <laughs> sitting in a bush. Yeah, no, he's in a bush Good. this time. Driver. A moment when we both <laughs> used the loudspeaker. I would only imagine what that looked like inside of a police car. <laughs> Give me it back. <laughs> God damn it. Did you want me to get it out? Uh, I think it's 60 or King 30 available. Oh, for what? Uh, King 30, what are, what are we available for? <laughs> You're an idiot. <laughs> You're an idiot. <laughs> okay, a request for a 51. 1051? Oh, a 71, uh, 71. Uh, we have a 1011. Let uh, us take care of that. We'll stack it. Traffic, uh, but we can go ahead and stack that 1071. Proceed, King 30, proceed with traffic. 283 westbound of Hammer Drive in Sandy Shores with a gray Isaiah occupied times one with one individual wearing a mask. And a How suit. you doing? So 32s. Yeah. You got King a license on your registration on insurance? Gray Isaiah, yeah, yeah. times one. Yeah, good. Any reason why I stopped you today? Okay. Sandy Shores. I was just trying to catch up to him just to see what he was doing. So we had another officer stop you, or trying to stop you for speed, but he lost you. Uh, we saw you turn around a car and recklessly go around a corner. Maybe it was a different person then. Yeah, maybe a different one, because I think if he would have been next to you, he would have pulled you over. No, I never said you were speeding. I said I saw you overtake a vehicle and take an aggressive right-hand turn. Do what now? Uh, this Dude. motherfucker just pointed a mini yeah, Uzi at me. Okay, uh, so did you yeah, hand me your I license, registration, insurance? Yeah. <laughs> I, I got you, but I'm saying I thought I was allowed to like overtake vehicles. Yeah, you can overtake vehicles as long as it's in a safe manner and you're yeah. designated to actually um, be able yeah, to overtake them. Well, you overtook them at the time that you were basically ready to be making your right hand turn anyway, so it went from a overtake into a right hand turn all in pretty much one motion. I know. Is that not like legal? No. You have to, your your overtake has to be singled out to itself, not included with the right hand turn. You're overtaking a vehicle, you're not taking a turn, are you? I was overtaking to turn. You were overtaking to turn, but what did you end up doing? You overtook and turned. I overtook and then I turned, yes. No, you, you don't put the then, take out the then. You overtook and oh, turned, overtook all in one I motion. I, I was in, but, but see, I overtook and then I was in the lane for about like 0. 0.2 seconds and then I turned. Okay, if you want to go ahead and discuss this further, that's totally fine. My partner can go ahead and discuss it with you. We've got another call to go out to, so the faster I get this done with you, the faster you're on your way anyways. Well, 
let me go like right now? Not right right now, but maybe soon right now. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I got work to do, man. I got work to do too. Yeah, man. How's it going? If you wanted to make my job easier, you could have had an easier you name. All right, man. How you doing? Uh, you know, doing great. Cool. <laughs> cool. Matter if I get my briefcase. Good talk. Up, good talk. Good. <laughs> God damn, both of you. Uh, no, Jesus. don't be reaching for anything or getting on the vehicle. Wait, We're almost you don't, done. You don't mind? Oh, man. I do See, mind. Hey, way to go. Get back in the vehicle. You, you, you said you didn't no, mind. No, no. Way to go. That wasn't my fault. Way to go. He said, I didn't can spell I his my... name right, and it actually oh, still oh, did it. What? That was right, weird. Listen, you said, do you mind if I grab my briefcase? And I said, do not step out of the vehicle. And I, the first thing I said was, do not step out of the vehicle. He stepped out of the vehicle. So you said no. He has obstruction charge before, so you can see this is something he does often. You said no first. What's with the mask? I don't want to catch the disease. 10-4. 2 Lincoln, 2A2, direct to King Fair enough. King 30, go ahead. Sir, I have a subject uh, on a 1011 at 091 CB Road. He was seen exiting Sandy Shores when you guys were doing your clearing. Uh, I believe it might be your subject, but there's no way to verify. Is there any way you can route this way to verify this? Oh my God, tell him we'll go there before we go to our 71. We're gonna go ahead and arrive there before our 71 call. Uh, if you wanna get his name, his name is Tony Montana, was the suspect who fled from us. Dude, I love how it's auto doing the name even though I'm not spelling it right. So Jordan Cash, however, all he has is a library card, no identification. That's not our guy. But we'll verify just to be uh, safe. We'll be there to verify after our tunnel with us. Control five by two two nine. On a library card. Five by two two nine. Okay. Can you confirm the unit you're requesting a ten seventy one? Uh any uh seventy one at this time. I believe it was King thirty. I was gonna assist. Okay. Receive late response. Now you up to your 1020. 10 4 is still gonna be at uh, 090 westbound lanes on Joshua. What's with the damage on your uh, right front bumper here? Did you hit I something? Was, uh, 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 no, I mean, it came with the car. It came, it came with, with the car. car. Okay. Yep. Yeah, man. Oh, right, you didn't hit that car. You're a passenger or anything? All right, let's go ahead and get this guy out of here with a. This has been so many fucking verbal cita or written citations. Okay, sir. No, this is a written uh, warning. Where did the fuck did that ATV just come from? This is gonna be for your right of way. You took the you uh, overtook the vehicle to take the turn when they had the right of way to do it first. Okay, so it's gonna be a written warning. Okay, that's great. We've established that many times. Again, it's a written warning, so you can sit here and go back and forth. You can just take the shit and then drive away. <laughs> like... <laughs> okay. So here's uh, your written warning along with your license back. Please, if you're gonna overtake someone, do it at an appropriate time, not when you're about to fucking rip a right-hand turn. Okay. Okay. You have a good day. Alright, thanks, man. Fucking shit. Over there arguing with me about a right hand turn that you fucking overtook a vehicle for. Oh! 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 Oh shit! Oh! Oh, it's gonna go down. Get us units. Damn, you piece of shit. Four people getting out of the car right now walking towards the vehicle. Okay, everyone calm down. Don't do anything crazy. Okay, just say, hey, 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 relax, 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 relax. Come back to your car. No, no, he just hit this, my neck. Five individuals right now. Man, why are you like that, bro? Which one did it? Which one Everyone relax. Which one did it? Which one did it? Get on the ground, damn it. Don't fucking move. Don't move. I need help. We need to get these fucking units here. What did you do to Tyrone? Take 30, step them up faster. We got money people fighting. Dude, back up. Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. Back okay, up. Okay, okay, okay. Uncalled for. Hands up. Everyone put their fucking hands up. Hey, I am victim. Hey, hold on, hold on, man. That, that's actually sort of unsafe, bro. Can you please, like, No, get on the ground. I'm gonna throw you on the ground again. Do you hear me? 
Fire, you're, not gonna, you're not gonna touch him. He's our employee. Stay on the fucking ground. Oh my god. You don't touch him. Everybody chill. Don't take him. Don't take him. Everybody chill. Don't take him. Everybody chill. Don't take him. 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 Don't take Don't take him. 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 Don't Oh, going shit. Down. oh shit! Going down! Oh that's shit! Uh, that's the attacking the officers. That's King 30, step up the units. Oh. We have officers getting hit. Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Step it up, code three, please. Oh my god! I'm right around the corner. Elba, out, out. Is it okay to attach? 1040, clear. Elba, come. Elba, come. Everyone, stop moving. You guys are going to fucking jail. I, I know, I know, Rem. Bok, Elba, Bok, Elba, Elba, Bok, Bok. Detain all these people. Detain them all. There's one subject to walking away. All right, face away from me. This is the guy, this is the guy. I'm going to get the guy that hit me. Face away. Makes no sense, I've done nothing wrong. All right, you guys got him. Hello, what is going on? What is going on? Up, Stay on the fucking ground. Elba, come, Elba, come. You guys never told me to stop! You just what? hit a fucking cop. Get on the goddamn ground. Hey, Elba. Hey, Elba. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Elba, Coach. Stay away. You're going to get bit by the dog, that too. Let's turn around. Elba, Bach. Elba, Bach. Sit right there. What the you talking about? What the turn around. What the? What is he making that sound? I have a dog. If you run, I will release the dog. I just ran up and tackled his ass when he was trying to walk away. Like these motherfuckers. I knew it was gonna go down. Okay, someone, uh, so, someone, I'm gonna go in and for cuffs. I did not know you guys are coming at me. Dude, don't, don't, don't turn no, 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 around. No, 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 I'm just thinking. Like and, and, and I do nothing, and I do nothing. You guys know uh, the dog. Yeah, I like, I mean, I'm I like you guys. I'm a bodyguard, bro. I got a pistol. I know nothing. I know nothing. I was in the back seat of the car, and another car went boom and hit my neck, and then I tried to kick his butt. Okay, are you over there with oh, the other hey, people? Yep, I got the guy okay. who hit you with brass knuckles. You, oh god damn. So I'm, I'm leaking kill. right now. Good so you kill, need Elba. to just take... I saw it, I you know saw the it. two people that are what over... You know the ones that hit okay, me, right? Just, yep. I okay. Right. I got one right now. Okay, okay. Right, what? I, I'd like to know why yeah, you tapped Yeah, I, uh, I got hit with brass knuckles, so I'm gonna need some... Yeah, okay. Gaz. Yeah, we're gonna have to... King 30, if you can roll 52 to the scene, uh, we had one officer hit with brass knuckles. Man, holy Got shit. Got Moscow here, gun you need to see. Control any available, you can activate 1052 oh. advice. Holy shit. It went, it went down. It went down. It went down. Right when I ran behind the SUV to get a better point of view to them. That's when it goes you, down. You literally said, shit's going down. I said, yep. shit. And that's the thing is every other time we don't need cops, there's a million. And then when we need them and we're screaming Dude, over the radio, so get us scarce. units code three. And it's like, no one's fucking there. Hey, you oh my God. I literally said, step them up three times. Yeah. And, and then I got to get on the radio and scream like, holy shit. Here, let me touch your head. Let, let me touch your fucking head. head. How do I, where does the lay on the ground like injured or I want to just sit. Pass out. Oh, you want to just sit? Okay. Yeah. Slash E, sit then. Well, there's a lot of sits. There's sit two, sit three, sit four. You'll have to look at them yourself. Uh, you sit. Oh, there we go. That was yeah. crazy. The Holy guy in shit. the hey, white, you guys or the guy in like the light clothing, was the one who hit you with brass knuckles. The guy in the light clothing. Yeah, the, the one that made his way all the way coming. away. The, 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 the one that was like halfway down the patch there that I tackled. No, the guy that's in the back of our cop car right now. Okay. Which you don't know that who that is, so I'll show you later. Okay, so did the guy in the black mask that we were dealing with, did he do anything? Uh. So wait, hold on. To make it easier, the three guys in the circle right there with the trooper right next to him, those guys are the good ones because they, they haven't moved at all, right? They probably got detained and are sitting in the same exact spot yeah. that they've been in the whole time. So yeah. all the other ones are the ones that were involved in the assault. The, the only thing is that I didn't see the exact person who 
the guy in the black suit who hit you, I didn't see that person directly because they're all wearing suits. If could have I didn't the see any on the road to the specific thing, so you might have to review your bike info to see who Yeah. Okay. I know the one guy, the white guy, that was sitting on top of the that uh, burnt-out van, he hit me. The one that you okay. ran up there and tackled because I was trying to tackle and I couldn't tackle him and you just went up there and did it? <laughs> yep. That, that guy, I know he hit me, along with someone else. But I think there was just two. I don't know if anyone else hit me in the... There was, there was a guy right there. Right? There's so much going on right now. Yeah. There's so much cars. I believe the guys that are in that circle right there that you guys are standing in front of had nothing to do with it. The ones that had something to do with it are in, all in vehicles. Yep. I think that's correct, yeah. Can someone grab me a med bag too? Yeah, I just grabbed it. Yeah. King 30, we can go and lift the air at the time. Clear. Uh, it's in Shell Unit, it's in Shell Unit, that's 0729 Zulu. Bandage your head. Lift it. Your oh my god, that was so fucking intense. I can't believe that. T right when I walked by that SUV, you said shit's going down. I tasered the first person that I could get to at the time. I got to remember to put oh, armor no, on. Because if I were to put armor on, there wouldn't be nearly as big of an issue with getting hit a few times to where I died like I did. Yeah. All right. County's here, by the way. So uh, be you can okay. check out by them. East Joshua Road on a black Ford I saw I lifted the air. Did you get hit pretty good? Yeah, he, uh, a couple of them attacked me. I guess one of them had a pair of brass knuckles on him, or in their hand. Uh, County's checking me out right now, so I'm gonna see what they can see. Yeah, take that fucking throw it on there and keep that swan down. So, uh, keep County, take a look at you and we'll figure it out from there. Can someone take my body cam and review for... To see if any of the guys in the black suits hit me with, uh, I'm not sure if it was any of the guys in the black suits or the one with the black suit with the face mask on. Okay. Yeah, if, uh, if you want to hand it here, we'll uh, throw it in the truck and figure it all out. Oh my god, this went down quick. Yeah, we do know for sure the, the white guy with the suit that made it halfway down this grass thing that I chased after, he's going in because he assaulted me. The other one that okay. Josh was talking about that had like a gray outfit on. He's going in because he's the one that had the brass knuckles. I just need to determine if the black suit guys had anything to do with it. There wasn't. A, there was a okay. 1050 here that provoked all this, but it escalated very quickly. Yeah, I got you. All right, yeah. Let me uh, throw this in here. Uh, Darnell, hey, so appreciate it. So the guy it. that's in our truck to, is gonna get charged for illegal possession. Yeah, of the uh, weapon. Oh wow. Okay. Oh, good. Guns, and there was guns involved? Them, She's. Oh, no, the well, brass no, knuckles. Brass knuckles yeah, yeah. yeah, let me throw this in the thing real quick. Cannot fuck to control. That's a Can deadly I weapon, is it not? Yeah, deadly weapon. Assault with a deadly That's weapon. weapon. Okay. Oh, my God, that explores. Oh. On my screen, the van's there, so it just looks like he's just burning rubber in the middle of the street for no reason. <laughs> like, okay, dude. Okay, I don't. I, I think we got the two individuals that assaulted us already 10 15 yeah, and booked. Only two. So. The other guys in the black outfits, I think they were there for security detail and they ended up standing in the way, but not actually assaulting me. So I think we got what we need. And if they're not uh, replying, we don't need to wait around for them. All right, cool. Sounds good. Okay, I appreciate it. If I could just grab the body cam back, we shall be good. Oh, uh, yeah, no problem. One of those lovely nights in Sandy Shores. All right, so we're going to need three tow trucks. I appreciate it. Thank you so much for doing that. Yeah, no problem, of course. All right, man, you have a good one. Use. Thank you. What did you say, three? Yes, times three. Well, no, 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 because one, that guy's driving his black car away. We're going to need two. Yeah, oh, they're all getting three. in. It seems legit. They're off here now. Uh, yeah. yeah, you guys are good to go. We're just gonna get tow trucks here. I appreciate it. Oh, that's, that's good. Oh, that was intense. Holy crap. Yeah, that was way too intense. And it's confusing because they're all wearing the same thing. Wait, so when it went down, <laughs> I was like, was who's right. doing what? Like. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, we had it at first. The people that assaulted me were by the gray, uh, by the gray car right there. So. Say one now. Yeah. yeah oh, I did not mean to click my push to talk there. I apologize. I was on Discord. Oh, you good.
Yeah, because you were standing like right here, and the two people who assaulted it, they you. They were just the right there. there. Yeah. yeah. And, and then I knew once watching. I walked away, it was going to be bad because people were going to start to get mixed up. And it's like I knew exactly who that who they were, except for the one guy that tried to walk away. I mean, we could honestly, we could have handed out a little more obstruction charges probably to people yeah, definitely, because definitely. I had told people to back up more than once and an assault occurred during that. So there could have definitely been way more arrests. Um, Control two, nine, one, yeah, they lucked out. Uh, County Tell is taking these vehicles, by the way. Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be where we wrap up this Blaine County Sheriff's Office patrol in the Dodge Ram. I'd say that actually was a really good patrol. Uh, getting in there, doing a lot of back-to-forth calls. Um, no pursuit or anything like that, but I think these calls were very engaging and a lot going on. Nonetheless, thank you all so much for coming out and watching this episode of DOJRP, and we will see you next video.